This is House of God number 62. my ninth year in campus ministry here at Rutgers. Uh, it's about my fifth or sixth year as director of the Catholic Center. When I first came, if we had 20 students go on our weekend retreat, we were thinking, wow, this is great. We just finished our spring retreat last weekend and had 110 students on that. The old Catholic Center, I have definitely a lot of memories in that place. As our ministry has grown over the past four years, we, we really outgrew that place. There were only four sisters living in this house at the time they moved out, and it was such a huge building. I mean, it was built to house probably close to 30, 40 sisters in its day. I think the location is great. Uh, it's right across from Old Queens, right next to St. Peter's Church, all uh, planned through the Diocese of Metuchen. It's great to have a new building, uh, not necessarily because the building is gonna attract, you know, 50,000 students to come be part of our organization, but it's just great that we finally have a, a facility that reflects the quality of what we're doing. The whole place has Wi-Fi access, so the students, wherever they are, can have internet access. There are several meeting rooms which can be used for meetings, conferences, but then during the day, they're all available. I come here a lot of days in between classes to study. Sometimes we have speakers and sometimes we have parties. A couple weeks ago, we had a speaker who was a survivor of the Rwandan genocide. The next week, we had a Mardi Gras party right before Lent. While the building is important, it's what we do uh, that makes the building important. And so the work we do on behalf of the students for their own spiritual formation, their spiritual welfare is what really the ministry is about. And, and the building just gives us the tools and the resources to be able to do that uh, more effectively.